Damn it, Morty. Hey, what's up, everybody? It's Why Not the Creator, and I'm back with another GTA 5 online video. And in today's video, I got a solo, fast, easy car duplication glitch that'll make you guys tons of money about 1.8 million every like 10 minutes something like that you know what i mean so if you guys like uh come to make tons of money from this so you like this video it helps you out uh all i ask is you smash that like button for me let's get like 100 likes on the video please i would uh, appreciate that also make sure to subscribe if you haven't already and hit that notification bell so that you can always stay up to date you can never miss out on any of these great money glitches or clothing glitches that i put out so uh, with that out of the way, let's get into the glitch. What you're going to need for this glitch right now, the requirements, is you're going to need an Arena War workshop, Arena Wars Garage workshop, just like the one that I'm in, like that. And you see right here, you're going to need to have some free LG RH8s in your, in your Arena Wars workshop garage. You're also going to have to have an MOC and a bunker. So you're going to have to have, you know, you can't have the MOC without the bunker. So you're going to have to have an MOC, you're going to have to have a bunker. And in the in the Bay Area 3 of the MOC, you want to have that as your personal storage area. And you want to have the car that you're going to duplicate in there. So you want, you know, like most people use the, the Arena Wars cars, like the Future Shock Izzy, you know, that sells for about 1.8, you know, almost 1.8. And then there's this other car I'm using. It's uh, the Future Shock, like ZRs and then like a whole bunch of numbers i don't know right now um but i'll show you guys the car later and uh because i i put a uh, transferred benny wheels on it uh it sells for a little bit more it sells for about like 1.8 a little bit more than the izzy shock so that's why i'm using it uh but you guys could use actually any vehicle that you like so if you have like a benny's you know like a benny's vehicle that has like the you know like some uh, customizations fully upgraded you know use that if you have the uh, you know any arena wars you know, vehicle that's fully upgraded, and uh, by all means, use that as long as it can fit in your, you know, MOC. So, like this big ass behemoth right here next to me, they say you can't use this thing, the Sea Breeze or whatever it's called. I don't know. Uh, Celebris. Uh, <laughs> oh man. But anyways, yeah, you're gonna get. You guys are gonna need that. You're gonna also, you see, in the, your, I'm in an invite only session, and then uh, the last uh, couple requirements you're gonna need is if you go to settings. Uh, as you can see, I'm in a free aim. I'm in free aim targeting mode, and you can do that from by going into story mode and then setting your targeting mode, and then just from there going into the invite only session because you're gonna have to be in an invite only session. So I mean, it, it's pretty, you know, it's uh, it's a no brainer to just start out in story mode, change your change to free aim, and then go to invite only session online. Uh, and then from there, also, you're going to want to have, uh, if we go over to online and the options, you're going to want to have your matchmaking closed. See, like that. You just want to have that closed just like that. So if you have all of those things, then I think you're ready to do this glitch. And you're ready to make some money. Let's get that money. Get that money. Oh, 20 on my shirt. Yeah, I love this shirt, too. This is a pretty awesome t free t-shirt that I got the other day. Oh, and plus I logged in today. And uh, if you, as you can see... I got like a two hundred and fifty thousand dollars for like nothing. I don't know what I did, but hey, I'll take it. You know, free money is always a good thing. So, with that, with that, my jabbering out of the way, we're gonna get into this glitch. What you want to do to start out? You got all that thing set up. Everything's all ready. This is what you're gonna want to do. You're gonna open up your phone. You're gonna go and you're gonna call like Gerald, Simeon. You know, so whoever can give you a job. So, you know, Martin, wh whoever it is, you know what I mean? So we're going to just go to Gerald. We're going to request a job. What's going on? Okay, request a job oh, just like that. that. That's the first step. Now he's going to text you and you, you'll get the job notification in like, you know, a couple seconds. You just want to go into your, you know, your office right here. See, there's the Gerald mission right there. So all you're going to want to do from here is you're gonna open up your phone and you're gonna go into the Gerald mission just like this, but you're not gonna accept it. You're gonna walk up to this you know, to this uh, career board, like just stand in front of it, and then you're gonna hold the options or pause button. Hold that down, and then as soon as you let go of it, you're gonna accept the that you're gonna hit X to accept that invitation to Gerald's mission. So you got to be like pretty quick on it, uh, quick. To get it you know what i mean so make sure that you hit it because if you don't get it then like the rest of the glitch won't work but just like as soon as you let go just hit x at the same time so it's 
just like that. You see, it and you'll get it if it pops up. You know, like the the menu the menu pops up and you hear it in the background. The phone click. So that's what you're listening for. Uh, from there, you just want to go and purchase shark cards. So you're just going to go into here real quick, and then you're going to back out. Now, before you back out all the way completely, um, if you're on the PlayStation 4, I'm playing on the PlayStation 4, so I'm, this is the controllers I'm telling the controls I'm telling you guys to do. If you play on the Xbox, it's just the um, opposite of what controllers I'm telling you because I, I don't know the the Xbox One controllers, so you know what I mean. So I know th uh, this is PS4 controllers. So what you're going to do is when you back out of here, you're going to spam right on the D-pad, and and as soon as it takes you into the career wall, you're just going to hit L1 and uh, triangle. So if, so if you guys are ready to do it, we're going to hit B to we're gonna hit circle to back out spam right on the d-pad and right there like that see and you got the leaderboard popped up and then you went into the mission this is exactly what you want to see just like that all you want to do from here is you have the leaderboard behind the mission you have that matchmaking closed so nobody can join you and, and ruin the glitch so from here you just want to hit circle to quit hit x to confirm you see, and it's going to take you back out to here. All you want to do is hit circle to get rid of the leaderboard thing. And then now we're going to walk out of the office and down the stairs. So just, you know, make sure you follow the steps exactly. Because if you don't do it, like, the right way, you can mess up the glitch. And then you have to, like, start up, start over. So you're just going to head down the stairs. And then you're going to go to the right into the spectator box. Now, before you go in here, you're going to hit... What you're going to have to do is you're going to have, we're on the PS4. I, I'm not sure with the Xbox, but it's you just whatever the buttons for PS4 just uh, converted to like the Xbox one. I'm sorry, guys, about that. I play on the PS4. So the buttons are going to be triangle, X, circle. And then as soon as it goes blurry, hit square and then hold down the, the D-pad and pick a story mode character. So uh, if you guys are ready, here we go. It's going to hit triangle, X circle square hold down and choose franklin and then it's going to say do you want to quit we're going to say no and see it should put you outside and it should be blurry now that's exactly what you want to see now from here uh the reason why before i said to uh, join a free aim lobby is so that you can go um choose like a friend that's playing uh uh you know gta 5 and try to and join his session but don't accept the alert and it'll it'll bring you back here as a uh, as the screen is clear so let's do it right now so you just want to join your friend that he's probably in a different targeting uh system than you that's why i chose free aim so that it's easier and all you want to do is see is when you get this alert to join a session you're going to hit circle to deny it so we're going to say no and see now it makes it clear it's not blurry anymore and that's exactly what we want and now on to the next step we're going to go and order the soda from here all you want to do is Go up to open the phone and we're going to go to play a uh, quick job. And as soon as we click this, it's going to make us invisible. And then we're going to just hold the PS button, the little circle button in between the analog sticks. Hold that down for like five seconds and it'll it'll like uh, dis, you know, turn off your controller pretty much so that you can get that alert. And then all you have to do is turn it back on and spam right on the D-pad to order a soda. So we'll go into click, Steve, our, I'm holding down the... The turn off um, controller, holding down the PS button right now. See, now it says your controller. Do you want to reattach? We're going to hit. We're going to hit the PS button to turn it back on. And then start spamming right on the D-pad to order the soda. delicious now from here all you want to do run over to see so from here you're going to go up to the blue circle and access your security camera by hitting left on the d-pad you just want to go in there look around oh yeah everything looks great just back out of it and then get into one of the cars and drive out And you see, you should fly through the, you should fall through the, you know, the map. And now we'll land on Mount Chiliad. You don't have to pull your, your uh, parachute or anything. Don't do like that. Just let yourself fall. 
And then now you don't want to call out any personal vehicles. Uh, all you want to do is open up your interaction menu and you're going to go to the CEO and register as a CEO and then just call your helicopter so that you can fly over to the bunker. So you go into the CEO, go down to vehicles and the helicopter is free to call and it'll spawn like right, yeah, see right down there. So from there, you just want to get in that helicopter and we're going to head over to the your bunker, wherever your bunker's at. Mine's right next to the prison. So I'll meet you guys there. All right, see, so we're here at my bunker now, or, you know, or, or, you, or when you're doing it, you'll be at your bunker. But you see how there's no, like, mini-map in the, the bottom or anything? So that's exactly what you want to see as well. And uh, you, know, and, uh, you want to make sure that you have, like, some piss wisers, at least eight of them, so that you can get drunk. So all you want to do, enter the bunker. All right, see... And that pretty much is the setup. That's the whole. That, like, that's the hardest part of this glitch is just doing that first part like that. Once you got that part down, like after the, like this part and like after, like you could just rinse and repeat, um, starting from here, like going to get the car, you know what I mean, and parking it out here and stuff like that. So this is that's what's great about this um, glitch is that you could fill up like your whole um, Arena Wars garage with like free free LG RH8s, and then you can, you know, just dupe those and make them into you know 1.8 million dollar vehicles. And you can get rich in no time. So just enter your bunker. And you see, ladies and gentlemen, this is the car that I'm duping. Uh, still doesn't give me the name. Should now when I enter it. Uh, it doesn't tell me because it's blocked out. So all you want to do is enter the car, whatever it is. If it's the free Izzy or whatever car that you're duplicating, just enter it and drive it out. Yep, see, and it'll put you right here in that square. You just want to park it right about here, you know, right, yeah, right about there. And you see, I got the Benny's wheels on this car, so it looks dope as hell. And it's called like the Z, or I really forgot the name. I, I'm telling you guys, I'm sorry, but it, it's one of the Arena War cars, you see. And watch, you'll still, you'll see the license plate change. You see, right now it's fucked, so we'll we'll, we'll watch in a little bit. It'll change. So, anyways, from here, all you want to do is park your car right there and get out. You're gonna open up your interaction menu, and we're gonna get drunk now. So you gotta go to inventory. You're gonna go down to snacks, and you're gonna go to piss wiser. So you're gonna just double click X and hold it down to chug and drink the beer faster, and it gets you drunk like faster too. So. Oh, and see, my dumb ass. I got to take the mask off real quick, so give me one second. Yeah, like that. Now, now I can go to inventory, go to snack, and we're going to go to pisswiser and double click on X to, and hold it down to drink the beer faster. And as soon as the he drops the beer, you just you just do this you just double click X and hold it down. And he'll chug the beer faster, get you drunk faster, so you can pass out faster. And so, you know, this is what we're going to do. You have to probably, you have to drink about eight uh, beers before you pass out. So uh, I'll meet you guys when we pass out. So you don't have to sit here and just watch me chug uh, eight beers. Go. Cool. All right, see, he just passed out. See, and you usually like spawn at a, you know, at a hospital. So just depending on where your bunker is at, where you'll spawn at. But uh, my bunker is in, you know, kind of like close to Sandy Shores. So that's why I spawned in that hospital next to Sandy Shores. So see right here now, I'm just running down to this liquor store real quick so that we can fill up on our alcohol. And then we're going to call the CEO helicopter and we're going to head back to the arena garage. So in here. Hello, my friend. Can I buy king size Snickers? No, just kidding. <laughs> so just hit right on the D-pad. You're not going to be able to see it. The menu is not going to show you to like hit right on the D-pad and then just go buy you some of them piss wiser beers. See, I filled myself up real nice. Now I'm in a shoplift. Oh, I can't. I already sold it. So, all right, I already bought it. Anyway, I don't want to get any attention to. And that's the other thing I was going to tell you guys. Make sure you don't die while you're doing this because if you die, you'll actually mess up the glitch and you'll have to start up all over again. So don't die and don't call out any of your personal vehicles. Just use the CEO um, services and and use the free buzzard to get around. So I'm going to head back to the Arena War, uh, Wars garage and uh, I'll meet you guys there. So I've played GTA since like 2013 you know online and stuff so I, I pretty much know like where everything's at but you're not going to have like a, a map or a mini map 
and it's not going to highlight where your like your buildings and your stuff is at so you're not going to be able to like really know especially and except for if you know like the map of gta and i mean if you guys play gta for any amount of time you should know like where the, your basic like apartments and the, you know the arena wars at. you know it, you can't really miss this one it's a huge big old you know circle octagon or whatever uh, circle yeah I think it's like, uh, oval 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 uh whatever yeah you know don't quote me on that but anyway see so from here once you get to the your arena wars garage all you want to do is just enter it go to the workshop level all right, see, and you're just going to enter, once you enter in here, you're just going to go over to the camera again, this blue circle, and you're going to hit left on the D-pad. Just go in and then hit circle to back out. From here, you're going to get into the free LG RH8 and drive out. And you see you should fall through the map again. Just let, let it fall. Don't open your parachute. You'll land at Mount Chiliad. All you want to do is open up your interaction menu, go to the CEO, and go down to vehicles and order the free buzzer. And now fly back to your bunker. So I'm going to meet you at the bunker. All right, see, so you're back at your bunker for the second time. All you want to do is just enter it on foot. And see, from here, all you want to do is get into the car that you're duplicating and drive it up to that yellow square right up there. Do not drive it into the MOC yet. You do not want to do that because it'll mess up the glitch and you'll have to start all over and you'll be pissed off. You'll be like, why'd I do that? So just see, drive it up here, park it, get out. And now we're going to go into the MOC. Now you're going to have to walk completely through from the back to the front. See, I'm going to enter from the back and walk completely through each three compartments and it may look different yours may look different from mine but you just want to exit from that door it may be the front you know it may not be on the side but you still just want to exit make sure you exit trailer you see it and it'll spit you right out back all you want to do now from here is get into the car that you're duplicating again and you see the plate has changed you see it doesn't say fucked anymore it's a whole bunch of random numbers the the one that goes to that free lg rh8 and now we're going to drive it into the back of the moc so you pull up to the blue circle you're not going to get a, a notification or anything like that you just have to hit right on the d-pad and it's going to say that it's full you're just going to accept that and you just successfully duplicated a car you just made like 1.8 million dollars or at least a million dollars if you have an arena car or a Benny's car, you're making like at least a million dollars. So not bad right there. See here, let me show you the um, the plate. See the plate is ends with 243, GPM 243, something like that. There's the bar in the way, so I can't really see it. Now a minute, now you guys are done with the glitch. If you don't want to watch anymore, hey, I appreciate you uh, tuning in. Uh, make sure to smash that like button for me, please, one time. You know what I mean? If everybody just smashes it one time, then we're, then we're golden. You know what I mean? Also, subscribe if you haven't already, and uh, hit the notification so you don't miss out.